Uh, it's always fun, it's always excited, and it's always hard. So, no, in every single one of them is different, so. Uh, is it nice to be able to get that goal early, just to, to be able to play with a lead? Yeah, uh, I didn't feel that we had control of the game the first half, so I'm not going to say it's, it's a lucky goal, but we didn't have too many opportunities in the first half, but we took advantage of our very few opportunities, including the goal, and that, that gave us a little of air to survive the first 30 minutes that was all, all, all up state. But the second half, I mean, you guys feel like you really took control. You had possession of the ball most of the time and it really seemed like you took it to them in the second half. Yeah, we have to bring our standards up, our game up. I mean, we just play against an amazing, amazing upstate uh, team. I mean, I, I think that, to be honest, coming, coming to the game, uh, outside of being the top seed or MAC champion, whatever you want to say, I consider it Miami the underdog because Upstate is an absolutely amazing team. They played great yesterday. They played great today. I mean, uh, we're very happy and very proud of our job because we did it against an amazing team. With all this, like, what, what makes Miami? What makes this team so special? It just seems like you, you, even if you feel like you are the underdog, you always feel like you guys seem to find a way to come out on top. Uh, they say that winning is a, is a, is something. It's a skill. And you have to practice, and uh, we practice to we winners every single day. No, not just in the championship moment, but on the on the classroom, in the community, and in, in in your family. And and we just have we just try to develop winners. And uh, then the championship day comes, it's just one more opportunity to to show that you can you can handle it. And last question, now, just a little bit. Of, can you give us a comment on, on Jana Kirby, your tournament MVP? She just played outstanding all weekend. Uh, <laughs> You know, she's amazing, and probably she's the kind of player that not all the time get recognized because is the kind of an unsung hero. But absolutely, she she make a difference not just today, but just against Ball State, and not just during the tournament, but during the full year. I was surprised that she was not uh, she was not in in any of the MAC teams, but I'm happy that she was able to 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 come with the MVP of the of this tournament. Uh, someone I think it's a great analogy. It's it's like a Roomba uh, vacuum cleaner because. She, she's so easy to maintain. You, she just does the job, and you don't even have to carry her. She just, <laughs> she's just going to clean everything for you. So it's a great player, an amazing person. So I'm happy that finally we were able to recognize her. Another MAC championship for you guys. You know, just what, just walk us through that feeling a little bit. I mean, it's just an amazing feeling. We came out here with so much excitement today, and like wanting to play the game. And it was a tough fought game for the whole 60 minutes, but we never gave up and. We got the outcome that we wanted to. First half, it almost seemed like App State kind of had control of the game a little bit, even though you were up one to nothing on the score. What changed in the second half that, that we were able to get kind of put you over the top? Um, we were able to communicate at halftime about what we needed to change, and we made those minor changes on the field, which then led to us being able to possess the ball more. Perfect. And then uh, we were talking with the coach just a little bit ago. We were talking about you and your tournament MVP. He called you a Roomba. That you're able, a Roomba that you're able to just clean up every mess. Just can you just talk a little bit about Coach Puzo and just just the impact that that he's had on you and on everybody on this team. I mean, he cares about his players so much on and off the field, and at practice he'll push us to be the best player that we can be, and that just makes us want to go out and play just for us, but also for him. And then when you were named Tournament MVP, uh, I mean, you I saw it. You had a huge smile on your face. Just uh, you know, what was that feeling like? It was just excitement, and I was just very proud of how hard my team worked today and how hard that we all can get the win. It was just a great feeling. And then find out more details NCAA tournament tomorrow. Just, uh, but I assume you guys are gonna, you're all going to go out and just enjoy this victory? Yes, we'll definitely celebrate this victory. I think we all deserve it, and it's just going to be fun. We're excited.